Hey guys, welcome to Chives TV. Sorry, it has been a long, long time uh, since my last video. I apologize, but thank you for all the views and all the likes and a couple subscriptions there. I really appreciate it. I love you guys. Um, you know, I've been busy with uh, my other channel and I kind of want to share something and, you know, do a little bit of crossover. I'll still keep this channel and my other channel alive, but I just wanted to, you know, talk about a little bit of what else I collect. So you guys know I collect um, the Satchel Collectibles uh, stuff, which is also Hot Toys, and I collect Iron Man um, 1 6 scale figurines. Uh, I don't have one coming in for the next couple weeks. No, I do. I lied. I have Thanos coming uh, in January, so I'll get you guys a video of that. And I've got you know tons of video and content that I've prepared. That I will post up uh, and I will get back on it for full 2016. That's my commitment to you guys. But today I'm here to share my other love, Funko Pop. Do you guys know what it is? If you don't, then uh, yeah, don't do it, guys. It is a freaking addiction. I have a ton of them, so much so that I, 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 I kid you not, I literally just made my own business uh, to sell them. That's how much I like them, and it's it, they're so cool. They're they're the perfect gift. Uh, you know, like if you have like an office and it's like Secret Santa or whatever it is and you, you just want to buy them, they're like, they're small, they're great, they're not that expensive, right? Unless you go to really expensive, like, you know, collectible stuff, but um, I, I, I just really like them, but just don't collect them, guys. Just take it from me, don't collect it. Yeah, I run my own business and I probably shouldn't be saying that, but you know what? It's a freaking addiction. Anyways, so, well, Star Wars is coming out this week. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty excited. I'm actually gonna go see it uh, Saturday morning. Um, it's gonna be a, a, a hell of a morning. Hopefully I can actually uh, keep awake for this one. I've got hockey at like 11.45, so I probably won't get home till like 1.30. Uh, if at all, then I shower and go to bed and whatever. And next morning I gotta be at movie theater for 7.30 a.m. Yeah, that's dedication. So, in light of that, we have the first Star Wars Awakens box. This is, um, I can't remember what it's called. It is, oh, that's right. It's just called the Smuggler's Bounty. Yeah. Uh, I just got this. I know a lot of people have already been posting it, but that's okay. I haven't looked at mine yet, so I'm really curious to see what's in there. And uh, there should be some pops in here, so I'm gonna show you exactly what I collect and what I, you know, what I also sell from my other business. So let's take a look, guys. All right, unboxing. Just the old knife. Okay, didn't cut anything. All right, let's open it up. I guess. Uh... Whoa. Ooh. So what do we got here? Put this away. Uh, we got a patch. Let's see this up. Okay, I'll show this. High fatter patch. Let's see. Oh, that's pretty cool. Will it stick back? No, it won't stick back. Uh, what is this? Pin. Oh, cool. Hopefully, it focuses for you. Oh, let's see back either. All right, let's take a look what's inside. Oh yeah. Guess who's wearing this? A lanyard. Let's show. Whatever. Anyway, there's a lanyard. T-shirt. What is it even the right size? Yeah, medium. Let's see what kind of T-shirt this is. Stay aside for a second. So all of these boxes, so you can get them in Marvel Core, you can get them for Smuggler's Bounty, you can get them in Loot Crate, uh, you can get them for tons of variations. These boxes come uh, every two months. It's actually kind of fun. All right, let's take a look. Oh, yeah. Hot damn. I don't know. Hopefully, I can actually show you the entire t shirt here. I can't wait to wear this. Captain Phasma. And uh, that looks like a Funko Pop Captain Phasma. I that. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. Wearing this puppy. Hopefully, it's not too cold. Woo! 
I peeked before you guys, but there it is. My Funko Pops. Yeah. Oh, they're not damaged. Um, sometimes you hear kind of horror stories about uh, these boxes being damaged, which kind of sucks because if you're a collector, if you, you know, collect it and you know, you're kind of a box collector, then yeah, that kind of really not fun. So there's three variations. I've got, uh, uh, there's uh, three of them here that you can get. So anyways, let's take a look. Captain Phasma Chrome. Ooh, fancy. Look at that. Would you just look at it? Yeah, that's right, Chrome. Um, pretty cool. I'm a huge fan. Like, I, I love Star Wars, but I won't collect anything like Darth Vader or um, anything like that. Me, I'm a, I'm a Stormtrooper kind of guy. I love their armor. Uh, I don't know what it is with armors. I really like them. Uh, but this uh, Captain Phasma, you can get them in a regular whatever Captain Phasma comes in. But this one comes in Chrome, so that's pretty cool. And this TIE Fighter. Actually, I actually haven't seen this guy yet. Um, sorry, I'm looking at it. Not showing you guys. But there you go. And you can get them in a different variation. So I'm going to flip it over and let the camera focus in for you. But you can get it with a stripe. And I guess from what I hear, if you get the TIE pilot with uh, the red stripe there uh, across his face, he's a little bit more of a collectible. But you know what? I'm not going to complain. I think this is pretty cool. I really like it. Um, this is the first Smuggler's Bounty box that they've ever made. Um, overall impressions, uh, not bad for value. Uh, you get some really cool collectibles. And for me, um, I got what I like, which is, you know, cool looking Funko Pops. And this is what I collect. Um, if you guys are actually curious to see my other channel, I'll put the link right down there and you guys can go take a look. But yeah, no, um, wow, pretty cool. I'm more excited about the t-shirt, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Uh, t-shirt quality feels really nice too. Um, looks big to medium, hopefully, you know, it'll shrink. I'm not that big. Um, you know, overall, I'm super happy. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the lanyard. Maybe I'll give it to some lucky kid at uh, the movie theater or something. And then, uh, yeah, I'll keep all of these. But thanks for watching, guys. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, I will go ahead and post more stuff. For you, more content for Chives TV. I'm, like I said, I'm really sorry. It's been really hectic for me with uh, my full-time job and running this new business uh, that I've only opened up like late September. It's been a gong show. Uh, you know, I'm very, very grateful that these little guys are really loved everywhere around the world. Um, we've shipped more packages in North America than we've actually sold here in Calgary, which is kind of cool. Um, just goes to show you that there's love everywhere. Um, but yeah, follow us along. And, you know, click on subscribe if you, and click on like as well for me, uh, for my Chives TV channel. I will bring you some new content here shortly. Like I said, I'm sorry, guys. I've uh, been away for so long, but enjoy. And in the meantime, I will see you soon. Cheers. Take care. Bye, guys.